all the defensive mentality that you have to have, especially in the rugged conference like the Big Ten. Shot clock winding down. Tough shot for a Harper with only one on the shot clock left. There's Garza with his first rebound. Mathis knew that was off and forced him to get his hand on it. So fast, a freshman. Nice job by Ron Harper, Jr. Guy that doesn't get a whole lot of play nationally is Frederick. Knocks down the triple. Oh, this young man, Richard Frederick. Good defender as well. He's going to have his work cut out for him with Harper tonight. Seven to shoot. Oh, good look. Great pass inside, just past Garza. Oh, that was a little heat check there, a little early in the shot clock. Go down low, nice poke away from Miles Johnson. Mathis, one on two, and Mathis with the layup. Oh, that's a tough move. But that's, I, I love uh, keeping him honest in his own house. Luis Camp for th uh, two, a long two, I should say. Garza cleans up the offensive foul, he's gonna go to the line. Oh, nice adjustment by Garza. Go back down low, try and reward the big fella. I'll tell you what, Garza is working hard, but his teammates are looking for him, and that's a great combination. The fundamentals of this Rutgers team, something we haven't seen in this program in a long time. I agree, and their defensive versatility is impressive. And Frederick gives the Hawkeyes the lead with a big three. Garza and Craner right now on the floor. And McCaffrey. Unforced there that time, trying to get back on defense. Young lays it up and in. We're tied. Ebola for three. Oh, man. And that'll silence the crowd. This is a different Rutgers team. Tend to shoot. Ball got lost on the way up. Ebola drives. Oh, wow. Tough move. Beautiful touch. Connell thought about it, gets it inside. Carter. Oh, that's left a, hand over the top of Garza. That's a beautiful move. A very high difficulty situation with that shot. Yabola ran into Wies Camp. And now Mathis blocked by Garza. Chance to tie for Iowa with a three. Wieskamp drives instead. He's going to try and do it the hard way. Doing a good job fighting through the no call because he got hit twice. Well, Garza and Johnson are starting to go toe-to-toe -to -toe as well. Down low, Garza finishes. Flex, big fella. Harper, a bit out of control, ends up with a loose ball, though. And he goes oh. up and under. Ron Harper, Jr., Talk about some determination, Joe. We've had six different 7-0 runs or more from both teams as Young lost his footing into the hands of Toussaint, rolling around up ahead. Greener. These officials haven't blown many whistles for either team. Toussaint to the rack. A great move by Toussaint. I'm so impressed with that young man's mental toughness here tonight. Give him a chance to come back in this game. Because Bakari Evelyn had really two really good games. And now Harper over the top of Garza, long two. The only matchup between ranked teams in the country tonight. Garza, three. Right over the top of Johnson. You gotta give Miles Johnson a touch on the box. Young penetrates, dishes, got it blocked. There's Garza again. Nice concentration by Harper that time, get to the rim. Garza with the moves over Johnson, oh, had man. that ball. But that free throw line has been good for them. 13 of 15 in the second half, there's a big turnover. Underneath Harper, fouled and a chance for a three point play. Oh boy. And here come the Scarlet Knights. See where the Hawkeyes go. Here comes Frederick going down the lane. The lead back to the Hawkeyes. Boy, that's, a, that's ice water in the veins right there. Wieskamp for three. What a shot by Joe Wieskamp. That's a great counter. They win it. They wanted to go to Garza. Had a down screen. No gimmies in this conference as McCaffrey tries to get it in. He will. And another big win for the Hawkeyes here at home. They're now 9-1 here at Carver Hawkeyes.